What's up, family? It's your girl, D-Ray, the Divine Relationship Alchemist, helping you heal y'all. My son is telling me right now he wants to potty in the grass. Okay, KJ, go. Go, potty in the grass, go. We're in our backyard, all right? So, yes, he can potty in the grass. Um, okay, I'm sorry. I'm making this quick video because I want to be an advocate for feeling good, right? I really want to stress to y'all the importance of feeling good. Mm. I've been on this feeling good journey. I've been on this feel good journey for the last month. What do I even mean when I say that? What I mean is I've been being intentional about doing things that I know brings me happiness, joy, excitement, appreciation on purpose, right? Like not only going out to eat when my homegirl's like, girl, let's go eat some some lunch. Or not only going out to eat when my love, dream-wise, is like, come on, babe, let's go get something to eat. But hell, going out to eat when it's just myself just because I know that it's something that is going to add to my feeling good, right? Or even a little bit of makeup I've been putting on. I've been feeling good about it. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to put on some makeup. I done started enjoying the whole makeup process and because it makes me feel good and because I feel good while doing it I'm just gonna do it just because right uh, I'm the feel-good advocate now right I'm gonna help you figure out what you need to do to align yourself with all the things that feel good I need you to understand that feeling good is how we manifest period all right think about it when have you ever and and let me not say that there aren't those situations because there are situations to where the spirit of anger or the emotion of anger can allow us to get the job done right anger can allow us to get the job done but the predominant emotion and feelings that we want to experience are love joy happiness appreciation because those feelings are what align you with all the things that you want to manifest. If you can want to continue manifesting negativity, then stay negative. Stay mad, stay sad, stay depressed. If that's what you want to manifest. But if you want to manifest other things that add to your happiness, then first things first, you got to start feeling good on purpose. You got to do things that bring you joy. You got to be uh, intentional about doing the things that make you feel good. I'm in my little workout gear, went to the gym, because I know that makes me feel good. Sitting in that sauna makes me feel good, okay? I know what I got to do to get into that feel-good state of being. I'm in the backyard right now with my beautiful children, and they running around, and they enjoying themselves, okay? It makes me feel good. It makes me feel good seeing them smile, seeing them run, uh, just really experiencing their childlike spirit, all right? Being outside in nature makes me feel good. So what I even discovered today is that, stop it, KJ. Stop, come back over here. What I even discovered today is that when you be intentional about doing things that feel good, the little things that used to annoy you, you know, they don't. Because you consciously make the decision, I'm feeling good. I'm not about to let anything petty take me out of this state of being. Hi, baby. I'm doing good. How you doing? I'm making the video real quick. Can mommy finish her video? Yeah. Okay, thank you. I just realized that whenever I'm intentional about feeling good and I, I'm like, I get to a point to where it's like, I know things are going to happen. There are going to be some things in my daily experience that I'm not going to like, whether it be traffic, whether it be, you know, the girl at the register was rude. Uh, you know, I'm just... Whoever I'm dealing with, I can tell that they're not having a good day and they're projecting that energy outward. All of that, those are things that we're going to face on a daily basis. But when we decide, I'm going to be intentional about feeling good and I'm going to do things that allow me to feel good. I'm going to do the things that I know bring me happiness, bring me joy. When those things happen, it's like, uh-uh, 
I'm feeling too good to let petty stuff stop me. I'm feeling too good to become mad and frustrated at traffic. I'm feeling too good to allow what is outside of my control to to control my emotions. I can't control this stuff. I can't control this stuff, but I can control how I respond to it, right? The feeling good advocate, because feeling good is the work. If you can focus on feeling good, doing the work, right? If there's things in your life, if there's things that you've manifested, if there's uh, experiences, if there's a relationship, if there's a job, if there's a situation, that is not in a that is disabling you from being able to feel good then you got work to do right and when i say you have work to do what i mean is that you have to investigate your thoughts your feelings your emotions right your beliefs your habits you have to uh analyze those things and transform those things so that you can start feeling good that's what I'm here to help you do. I'm here to help you analyze the thought processes, the behaviors, the habits, the feelings, the, the things that we've learned from our family members. I'm here to help you figure those things out, heal those things at the root so that you can feel good, so that you can feel good about who you are, what you bring to this life, to this existence, okay? And what you actually want to create using the power of your mind, using the power of your words, using the power of your heart. All right? Feeling good is the work. Love y'all. Peace. Oh, before I go, go to my website, relationshipalchemy.org for your healing consultations. All right? If you know that you have not been able to get yourself in that feeling good state of being, you need to book a consultation with me. Be prepared for the vulnerability. Be prepared to answer questions that may be challenging, but I promise you, if you really, really want to experience this good feeling and you really, really want to manifest from that space of good feeling, right? Join me on relationshipalchemy.org. Go to my YouTube, subscribe, do whatever you need to do for us to be in contact, all right? I got a special going on right now, $25 20 minute healing consultation you can't beat it you're gonna want more go check it out